Hi, I'm Patrick, and you're watching Patadendron. Welcome back to another video. You guessed it, I am at another nursery, but I'm actually at Upland Nursery yet again. I just love coming here. They have a really good selection of houseplants, and you never know what you're going to find. I have found some really interesting Hoya, some Calathea, and some Begonias here. So they probably got some new stuff since we last came. And yeah, let's go check it out. Wow. They have this beautiful... Plumeria. It's a gorgeous color. It's $2.49. Oh my gosh, I could smell it through my mask. That gigantic begonia. Put this down here. For $38.99. That's a really pretty variegated something. <laughs> Another pretty begonia in that beautiful chartreuse color. They have Hoya Lachinosas. For $19.99. I heard that they were, um, they are prolific bloomers too, so. I honestly think that I'm really getting into Hoyas. It's happening. They have staghorns. Really pretty big um, stromanthes, trio stars. Oh, so we're good. They have some peperomia and a Carnosa Crimson Queen. Some Peperomia Angulata. Some Hoya Carnosa Compacta. Um, Crinkle 8. Hoya Australis Lisa. I just love how the leaves look. Such pretty variegation. It looks like it was painted on. And the pubic helix. Pubic helix. They have this. Beautiful Sissus Discolor. And they have the regular Hoya Australis too, not just the Lisa. It's in Brazil. More peperomia. And they have the syndapsis, silvery ann. Look how silvery this is. Hoya carii. Some 
I guess Tanakis. Pearls and Jade, Pothos, for $7.99. And how you can tell Pearls and Jade from Enjoy is that the Pearls and Jade has the green splashes in the white. Fun fact, I have one from Costa Farms, Walmart, but it's labeled as a manjula or a manjula pothos, pothos. And I swear it's pearls and jade. Also, if you ever notice why I say pothos and then I correct myself to pothos, it's because when I say pothos, I see it spelled out in my head with an A because of the internet. And so I quickly correct myself back to pothos. <laughs> Thank you, internet. That big gigantic one that I got from Plant Depot is an Enjoy. <laughs> I thought this guy was real. Just for a second. They have some Raphidophoras. Raphidophora tetrasperma. Dracaena. Song of India. Of all the Dracaenas, this one might be my favorite. African violets. More raffies. Some peperomia. I'm hesitant to get more peperomia until I figure out They have little baby ficus audrey or ficus bengalensis. Now I didn't know this, maybe you did, but the ficus audrey or the ficus bengalensis is the national tree of India. That's a ficus americana. Ficus auriculata everest. A durable and easy care house plant for a well-lit space. Large round leaves make a tropical jungle feel indoors. Ficus triangularis. Gasteria sakura fuji. I don't know much about this plant, but it's here every time I come here and... I like it more and more every time I see it. Ficus Lorata Sun Coast. I wonder what the difference is between all the different variations. Peperomia. Ooh, they have the whale fins. $49 for a large whale fin Sansevieria. $79 for that gigantic ZZ. They have some birkins. The 
Philodendron Birkin. Sangonia. And the Ficus Lorata Bambino. It's a dwarf version. Okay. The pots here go really quick. The ones that I got the other day for my repotting video, gone. Yeah. Here's an overview of their house plant room. So nice. Well, that is it for today's video. Thank you for watching my tour of Upland Nursery, um, today's version. <laughs> and if you haven't already, you can find me on Instagram at Petodendron, just like this channel. You can find me there and follow me so that we could be plant friends. And if you like this video, maybe you're inspired to go to Upland Nursery, maybe not. <laughs> But if you liked it, throw me a bone and give me a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of me, which I hope you do, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye.